Hello, this is Dan Fashionbauer from Video Pizzazz. And today I'm going to show you how to reinstall Windows 10 on an existing laptop. I just have a lot of clutter on this laptop and it's going to be going to a different user. So I just want to wipe everything off this laptop, reinstall Windows 10 for a clean install for a new user. Now make sure that you back up all your files that you want to save from this existing computer first of all. And I created another video showing how to do that. And I also created another video on how you can create your own Windows 10 disk image boot USB drive. That would be another way of installing Windows if you want to. But Windows 10 gives you a nice feature built into it that allows you to do the recovery. So what I'm going to do is you can either go down to the left hand corner and click on that icon and then come up here click on the gear get to settings or you can come to the right corner icon and click on that guy there and click on all settings and it brings up the same menu. It brings up the same Windows settings menu. So what I'm going to do is click on update and security. Come down here to recovery and I'll click on reset this PC get started. So you can keep files or you can remove them. I want to remove everything because I'm going to be taking this and giving it to a new user. So I'll click on remove everything. But again, before you do this, make sure you have all these files backed up so you didn't lose the previous user's data. So click on remove everything. This is, do you want to clean the drives too? In my case, I'm going to select the second option here called remove files and clean the drive because I'm not interested in keeping any of the previous user's data. So I'll click on this. All right, so it says ready to reset this PC. Resetting will remove all the personal files and user accounts on this PC. All apps and programs, any changes made to settings. This may take a while and your PC will restart. All right, it sounds like what I want to do. So let's click on reset. Okay, so we are getting there. Our reset is at 95%. All right, so as we wind down here, it looks like it's been about four hours for resetting. So I think what it's doing is it's uh, actually doing a format of the drive and then reloading the OS from scratch. So I will have a clean operating system of Windows 10 when I'm done with this. And I shouldn't have to worry about my Windows 10 product key either. That should have been saved and reinstalled with uh, resetting of the PC. All right, so now it looks like the uh, Formatting of the hard drive is completed and now it's installing Windows 10. Hi there, I'm Cortana and I'm here to help. A little sign in here, a touch of Wi-Fi there, and we'll have your PC ready for all you plan to do. Use your voice or the keyboard along the way, and if you'd like me to stay quiet, just select the little microphone icon towards the bottom of your screen. 
If you need an assistive screen reader, press the Windows, Control, and Enter keys at the same time to turn on Narrator. Okay, enough intro. Let's dig in. Your region is set to the United States. Is that right? Yes. Your keyboard is set to US. Want to stick with that? Yes. Do you also type with another keyboard layout? No. Now let's get you connected to a network. That way you can get updates, apps, and cat videos as soon as possible. How about the first one on the list? Want to use that one? Yes. Now type your credentials. Mission accomplished. You're all linked up. Now we have some important setup to do. Now let's see what's new from Windows. Next up, the legal stuff. In short, you'll need to select Accept to use Windows. You can decline, but the Type your email address or phone number, then follow the instructions to sign in. I'll catch up with you once that's done. Let's get an account going for you. You can use your own email address, or we can help you create a new one. Unless it says... I'm sorry. So I don't care about Microsoft advertising, so I'm going to turn that off. And in this case, I'm not concerned about tips and tricks for Microsoft either, so I'm going to turn that off and click on Next. Want to set up a pin? All right, so I'll create a pin. And click OK. Now let's link your phone and PC using a Microsoft app that can work some magic between your devices. We'll send you a text to get everything set up. Just type your phone number and press send. All right, I'm not going to set this up either, so I'm going to click on do it later. Hey, look, that's me, Cortana. Can I have permission to use the info I need to do my best work? I will say yes on this one. These are the settings Microsoft recommends. Go ahead and review them and select Accept when you're ready. All right, so then you can turn on or off any of these features here that you want. I turned off half of them and click on Accept. Almost done now. We just need to get a few more things polished up for you and Windows will be all yours. Looking forward to helping out. All right, so I'm just going to exit out of here. And I now have a totally clean install of Windows 10 on this laptop. All my icons and all my folder information has been removed. So if I come down here and open up a folder and go into documents, there's nothing. Pictures, nothing. And I have 424 gig free of a 443 gig drive. And we are all set to go after installing a new Windows operating system on this laptop. I hope you found this tutorial useful and we'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.